loyalties welcome back to the channel so this is DIY one of our six days of Christmas DIYs so we're going to take this poinsettia from Michael's craft store mind you I got it on sale you guys for five dollars it was half off and I'm going to take this recollections glitter in silver and in champagne as well as this rose gold beautiful bling wrap from totally dazzle and these beautiful rose gold poinsettias from Michael's craft store Again, on sale, I think they were 60% off or 50% off, I'm not sure, but they were less than $1.99. And I'm going to use these beautiful um, embellishments also from Totally Dazzle. You guys, if you need to purchase anything from Totally Dazzle, the link will be in the description box. And I'm going to be using this crushed glass also from Michael's Craft Store. Okay, all those things will be listed in the description box, okay? So, let's get started with this DIY. So, I'm going to remove my poinsettias from my flower. Um, pot because if you see in the center they are red and my Christmas decor this year is not the usual traditional color I am using um, pops of blush pink rose gold white and silver so I am going to paint that center just like you see with some white paint and sprinkle it with a little bit of silver glitter for a pop of bling okay so the next thing we're going to do there's okay let me tell you it's six flowers in all poinsettia flowers at all on, and in all i can't talk tonight sorry y'all in all on this flower pot and so i'm going to do three and three i'm going to do three um in one style and three in another style so the first thing i'm going to do on one style is re i'm going to paint three white the center white and then on the other three i'm going to cut them out okay and the reason why i'm cutting them out because i am going to Glue down those rose gold poinsettias right here with some hot glue in the center. But before I do that, I am going to take three of the petals on that one particular poinsettia. And I am going to take some Mod Podge and put it on the edges of three of the biggest um, petals on the flower. And then sprinkle that chunky um, champagne glitter on there. And then the silver um, super fine glitter on there as well then i'm going to add in my crushed glass you guys not a whole lot because i don't want the petals to be too heavy but just enough where there's some texture on that petal okay so i'm going to do that only on three of those and then i'm going to hot glue down the rose gold flower in the middle i hope that makes sense you guys just pay very close attention and you can see what i am doing All right, so now it's time to glue down the poinsettias. I'm going to use the hot glue, and I'm just going to press it right down in the center of the poinsettias that have the crushed glass on them. Only on those. So it should be three. Well, in my case, it's three because I have a total of six um, poinsettia flowers. And I am just going to share with you how I do my look number two which is just using the um, glitters on the edges of the big poinsettia petals. And then on the very small ones, I use only the silver glitter right down the center line of the poinsettia flower. This adds some dimension to that poinsettia. And then I top it off with one of those beautiful embellishment pieces from Totally Dazzled. So that's what you're gonna see me do here. So now I'm going to glue down my Totally Dazzled 
um, embellishment piece. And I'm going to put it right down in the center. Be careful, you guys. Be careful. Okay. Now, um, right after that, I've decided to go ahead and let it dry and change the flower pot paper because my color is not green. So I am going to change it to this silvery white. And this is the tissue paper that I am using. And it's from the Dollar Tree. It's like a metallic paper and white. And it's got a little design on it. Um, so I'm going to put the paper down, offset it so that I can gather it up around my flower pot. And then I'm going to tie it off. Well, not actually tie it off, but glue kind of like gather it up using the beautiful bling wrap from totally dazzle and y'all i am not hyping it up but that bling wrap from totally dazzle is everything y'all know i love dollar tree and everything and i love the dollar tree bling wrap but totally dazzle bling wrap hands down is even better than the dollar tree bling wrap and you get a lot of it for a an affordable price so you guys go check it out they got it in i think three different colors gold silver and this rose gold that i am using definitely worth it i'm gonna leave a link in the description box um it is an affiliate link so you will be helping me out getting a couple of little pieces of change if you do purchase from totally dazzle through my link so yeah check that out and now you see i am pleating the paper um i only did like three pleats on it and then i just glued off with this totally dazzle bling wrap Pop back on my poinsettia flowers, set it out on the table, and voila, you guys. I have a beautiful, glamorous, Z Gallery inspired poinsettia flower pot that I could not get in the stores. At least I have not seen it in any stores. And y'all, this is so easy to create and affordable. It really was very affordable. So, anyway. Here's a look at how I styled my little coffee table to share with you guys what the flower pot looks like. Be sure to let me know in the comment section below what you think about it. And also, if you're new to the channel and have not yet subscribed, what are you waiting for? Go ahead and click that subscribe button now and join us over here where you can see amazing DIYs. And right now we are in day one of our six days of Christmas DIYs. So... Be sure to go ahead and click that subscribe button and turn that post notification bell so that you don't miss out. And here's the reveal, you guys. I love you guys. Can't wait to see you tomorrow for our DIY number two. See you guys in the next one. Until next time, peace, love, and blessings. Bye-bye.